Yeah, I'm just gonna go out on a limb here and say that, uh... Yonder is not supposed to look this way. It actually looks this way on my monitor, by the way. It's, uh... Actually cut off right, right here. Uh, turn off generic capture and turn on display capture. Boom, look at that. <laughs> yeah, anyways. What is wrong with this game? That's that's gonna have to do, and hopefully the audio balance is okay. I'm a little worried about the. Anyways, yonder the cloud catcher chronicles. I wanted to play this, and I'm going to. So let me let me move the mic a little bit. There we go. I'm gonna be a dude, I guess. I'm gonna be a pasty motherfucker. Um, some brown hair. Macho man. That's good. Brown eyes. Boom. Hit and play. Our dearest child, it broke our hearts when we sent you away, but it was the only way to keep you safe from the darkness that poisoned our land. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm used to these things just going on by themselves. When the day comes that you seek the truth, trust in the celestial compass to guide you. What is this? Freaking... It will lead you far across the sea into darkness and into light, but it will always lead you home. What is this, Pirates of the Caribbean? Caribbean? Caribbean, I know the Caribbean. Home to Gemia. We're gonna call it Gemia. Seems about right. Why do I have to hit enter? Seems like the kind of game that'd be better on a controller. But I can't be bothered. Even though it's plugged in. The game's actually in big picture mode, which is probably half the issues that I was having with it. Boy, nice compass, mate. Oh boy, yeah, we're not using controller. That turning was way too slow. Oh my god, this is... He barely turning the mouse. Hey! Ooh. This is amazing, I thought Jimmy was just made up tail. Just a made up tail. I'm glad I came from the... Are you kidding me? I'm glad I came up from the kitchen to see this. I see what you guys did there. Can we like do something about this? Because I'm going to be sick. <laughs> like so the character movement feels slow, like you have to turn around, but then the camera movement is like whoa. Once your character gets going, whoa, he's unstoppable. I'm not talking to people. Mm. If that compass is yours is right, Jemia should be just behind the bank. Mm. I'm ready to finally see the island. I don't have a better option. If Wind Waker taught me anything, rain, lightning, and ominous violin music. Uh, I'm gonna go down here. Oh. Okay. So our ship just got exploded by lightning. If you're not Sprite Seer, you and your friends are safe. You will see them again, but first, you have a great task ahead of you. 
I am Airy, once proud protector of these lands. I have been waiting for you. Creepy. Please, may I see your compass? R to open the compass. Okay, that's telling us how to do quest stuff. As I thought a celestial compass, use it whenever you are lost. It will guide you truly, but for now, your path is blocked. My family can help you, but they themselves are lost. Find them, and they will lead you home. Now, Sprite Seer, awaken. Your journey has only begun. Boobity blah 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 blah. Yes. I mean... Part of the ship? Like the back part. I would like to know, actually, honestly, from a game design decision. Frickin'. I think the camera just sucks, honestly. That's a little better. Uh, from a design decision, how does that part of the boat get on the other side? Those aren't rocks, are they? I can't tell if that's part of the sailor or the rock. It doesn't matter. Also, if you move your character. Does that also happen? Yes, okay. If you move your character, the camera starts to turn with you. It's, I don't like that. I can't, I can't break that. Alright. A really blinding rock. I discovered stone. I don't really know anything about this game. I assume there's some form of crafting element to it. <laughs> I'm sorry. Anyways. All the people who could talk to me have gone away. Please take me with you. I don't want to be alone anymore. I would definitely buy a figure of that thing, so... Did I really not break things? I'm just looking for more stone. I don't know how useful that's going to be. You know, if the camera would stop moving, it's going to take some getting used to. But I can see platforming if there is any, getting really obnoxious. Because if you're not already walking in a straight line and you move the camera, or move the character, the camera is going to move you, and then if you're holding W, the moment the camera moves, you are facing the direction. Oh, that's, that's bright. Alright, we're never hitting that button again. I like how you can left click or F, and then it will constantly oh. tell you. The way out is just past the mark. Bad stuff for you humans though, I'll try to get rid of it, but I'm not sure if I can do it alone. Believe in yourself. The power was inside you all alone. Ah. Ah. Oh. Woo, that was hard. I wish I had my brothers and sister. Oh, we work together, I think we can find them. I don't know if I'm going to do playthrough of this, but the only thing holding me back from actually playing it is the fact that I wanted to do a blind video on it. I've seen up to this part. Uh, the reveal is amazing. There's some purple, some greens. Contrast of colors is pretty amazing. It's not just bland grays and dark colors. There's a village over there, let's go check it out. You really aren't looking the best. But we can find you some help there. Remember, if we get lost, you can use your celestial compass. M button. Intuitive controls. Amazing. Wow. Uh, what? So, interesting. I'm assuming that's gonna be... Gonna be explained at some point, but I guess you have regional happiness. I completely missed whatever was on the right. We're just gonna look around. So, okay, I guess one of my problems with the camera. That's a big caterpillar. One of the problems with the camera, so if if I walk forward, it actually goes behind the character, but if I move the camera, 
goes to the left of the character. But, I mean, it stays like that for a while. Kind of just slowly moves back to position. That was a blinding log, I take it. I discovered stick. Massive cities have been built, and I rode a boat made of sticks. Big sticks. All the way over here, but I only just now discovered a stick. Red shampoo. Alright. Getting dark. Lots of bloom on stuff. Oh my god. It is beautiful, I will say. If not occasionally blinding. I don't see anything else shining my direction, so... Pick another flower over here. Let's grab that. You never know what we're gonna need. Could just do the quest though, but... That is... that looks good. I like that. Yeah. I discovered Fairmont and the dude has a quest. But hold on, there's a rock. Go to this guy, it's the first quest I saw. Huh. That storm capsized the boat. It also destroyed the east docks. Now that's a big problem for us. Mm -hmm. Now did the boat or the storm destroy the docks? Probably both. This is a trade guild at Oh, you see? About the East Docks bringing in goods. We're not in any position to help you out. Okay. Uh -huh. Hmm. Hmm. I'm one stone short. And I'll just follow this arrow in the uh, top right. Or bottom left, one of the two. I like the quest thing, because it actually tells me to go way. I don't want to get clogged down with too many quests. Uh, tab opens up stuff. We won't get into that. Oh, so if I hit Q. Now, do I have to run up to a stone I can smash in order to even swing the hammer? Because if that's the case, I kind of have a problem with that. Oh. Yes. And I can't hold it. Interesting. I'm gathering a little bit extra stone because I will probably need it anyways. Can I hit the crate? No. Like I said, you can't just swing the weapon. Oh. And this goes ear, and that goes... Ah, oh, <gasps> hello there. Uh -huh. I'm gonna stop reading this now, because... It's kind of boring me. Quest complete. So I gave her, like, barely anything, and suddenly the whole dock is open. Okay. I guess that's making a lot out of a little. Treasure chest. That camera, though. Sometimes when you go to move it a little bit, it just swings like that. I didn't do that. Black room glass. Whippable. Of the hipster. Wow, this game makes tropes. It already made fun of women in kitchens. Oh boy. Looks like there's gathering, fishing, or gathering. I could sell those glasses, but I'm not going to. I'm gonna go back and speak to the dude. It is spring, day two of year one. So I can see the the kind of Stardew Valley references they said was going on here. 
the heck do you want? Ah. Yes, I didn't necessarily wash ashore, but sure. Sure. I look a little wimpy. Oh, okay. Oh, oh. My boat explodes and you call me wimpy. Or. Ah. Oh, it's a good thing I didn't buy ah. sickle. I thought it was telling me to hit enter for the journal, but... Okay. If the camera controls, don't kill me. Insert Zelda morning music here. I cut more than I need to, but again, hopefully it doesn't take it off. I'm not as wimpy as he thought. Cool. What a douche. Nice eyebrows. Okay. So he has big muscles and a big brain. Good for him. Hmm. Ooh. If I could just take this sickle and cut your big brain to pieces. I don't like that guy. If we hit tab, we can... Nope, that's not what I wanted to do. We've taken it from 26 to 29, so we get a harvesting bonus. That's interesting. So the happier we make the region, the better off our gathering and... Okay. I don't want to left click, because I thought I still had the sickle in hand. Trying to hit E. Okay. Oh, Q and E cycle, as well as the mouse wheel. All right. I was actually trying to see what they were saying about the, the seeds again, because I didn't take the time to read all of it. All right, talk to this guy. I'm liking this. Really am. Oh. I've held off for a while on the keep updating the game, making things a little bit easier and better. So, I think it's a good time to play it. They've done four updates now. Hello, Traveler, you look like you've been through some hard times. Oh, oh you know, my ship exploded. about died and all that. Come inside what you're lean to? I can offer you some warm food and a soft bed. Stranger danger. Back away slowly. The townsfolk warmly welcome you. Hope something bad happens to Sly McDouchebag face. Once your belly is full and your worries are eased, your head hits the soft pillow and you drift to sleep. Where Herbert the pervert does <laughs> his things, has his way with you. Oh hey! Speaking of which. There, that's much better. You look ready to face the world again. Just one more thing before you go. Oh. oh. Ever since that terrible accident years ago, Merc has been popping up all over the place, making life difficult. I'm gonna assume that's correct. Mm. But the people here are friendly and we love to share what we know. Um. Yeah, it's what you did last night, buddy. Ask around and you'll soon have all the skills you need to blah blah blah. Basically talk to people with exclamation marks and it'll be good. So the reason I like this game is because it reminds me a lot of Wind Waker, which is... Oof. It's got to be one of my all-time favorite games ever. I think I've played it like five times. Never beat it because, like, why would I? Oh, cool. Uh, yes. Warm milk and Sinoza seed. Can I can I have the tip about the seed again? Can you tell me how to spread my seed? <laughs> Shut up. It told me, but I wasn't paying attention. Now let's talk to this guy. Huh. They're all fat. I mean, that's alright, but like, they're all a little, a little chub. Oh, hi. I heard there was a new face in town. Huh. 
there. Door. I mean, trading oh. is literally swapping stuff for other things. Huh. Good thing I already collected those things. Mm-hmm. You can craft items to trade. Crafting items generally trade for a higher price, which is nice. <sighs> Here's a recipe to craft a bundle of sticks with those items. Even though the picture of the bundle was more than three sticks, but I'm not. Maybe you cut them down. So I have to complete 12 more quests. Talk to the people we see. Ah. Rainy over here, Minnie. Hmm. The old farm on the south field was abandoned when the merc <gasps> appeared. You can clear the merc. Welcome to the farm. I'd love to see the old place patched up and running again. Take this axe and gather the materials to fix the place up. 16 wood and 5 sticks. Too mm. plenty. I want that right now. So I need another sprite, I believe. Sprite was that thing that was like, hey listen, I'm your typical guide. What? A, a grovel? A giraffe? I didn't read it. And also, where is it? There, oh, there it is. Very cute. Very cute. Alright, you're shy. It's fine. Go ahead and smash up some rocks. Cut down some trees. I was going to trade those glasses and buy a bunch of stuff, but I kind of figured the game would get me what I needed. Uh, you know what? I need to stop hitting E and just left click. One cat found in the grasslands. So I just put a cat in my pocket. And will this tree grow back? Because I feel bad now. Oh, okay. Alright. So I can plant... Do I know what kind of seed that I have? This is like... Inventory. I got a mystery seed and I got a meadow fell seed. Which... Tree. Yes, I'm gonna plant a tree because I would feel bad. There we go. I got the green thumb achievement. Thank you, big picture. I hate you. Sorry about your tree. I'll plant another one. There we go. That's what it was saying about seeds. I could always keep the seed and uh, plant the mystery seed. 99 trees planted. Maybe that means 99 total. Nine. No, that's not tall grass. I mean, we could put the mystery... Yeah. Looks like a tree. Trees planted in the grasslands, yeah, sure. Get a little bit more wood, and then we'll go through that hole over there. Find out what's on the other side. And stuff. I have another mystery seed. Or maybe that's just saying out of all the seeds I have, I don't know. No, I definitely just have four mysteries. Uh, oh, now you want me to use the hammer. The game is some cloth. That's neat. And the Merc is up here. Some iron ore. 
Uh, neat. But we're gonna take some exploration. This person might have an idea where I can do the stuff. <sighs> and that bit should go there. Here for the murk, you must use sprites you have found. I need two sprites. So I go take everything to the builder, but I don't have another sprite. There's some ruins and stuff over here. I know I said I was going to end the video, but how can I? These aren't ruins, this is like an old house. I discovered a grass fox, apparently. Funny, because I thought that was a resource, and I was so ready to smash it open. That yeah, looks like we can... I kind of wish it would give me the potato seed. Like, am I allowed to smash up this person's house? Maybe I'm helping. I doubt it. So the remains of the Warren Diary, the Merc is just thick. Had to close the farm, although we're retiring, I hope one day it'll open again. I'll see to it. Maybe not this video. I kind of want to do my pointless exploring right now, because... Ooh. That's a weird looking town up there. Any looking. Go down here. This looks chock full of secrets. Ooh. Oh, clutch jump there. I don't know if I can go in the ocean. Old kingdom coin. Let's find out. Answer is no. Um, what is the punishment? Such. Oh, and another thing uh, that I did read in a quick update was... Oh, I can wear them. Cool. I can be a hipster. Anyways. And in my defense, the description, the core pillar of hipster fashion, so don't yell at me. Do I have that kingdom coin? Is that chest still open? Okay. I should just do the other quests. We're going to deliver the items back into town real quick. I like this. I like it a lot. Probably just because the uh, Wind Waker nostalgia. It's bright, colorful. Uh, it's got a nice little tune in the background. Not too keen on the necessarily when it comes to switching inventory. That's probably just something I'll get used to and become a thick, nasty pro at at some point. That's cool. He pulls out a little parasol. Little little thingy. I keep hitting tab to open the map. I don't know if this is the world map or this is just the area map, but we've done very little of it. And then we've got... Stop it. On the map, we've kind of got that little trail behind us. I like that, because I've been playing a lot of Final Fantasy XII, and it does the same thing. kind of shows you... A bundle of sticks. That's nice because that was the trading thing.
Uh, repair the farm. So all this is just part of the stuff. So I might go around and see what other quests I can gather up in the meantime. Uh, do a little bit of off-camber work. I don't just want to keep doing this for ever. That's probably another shop or something that'll open up. But yeah, I think that's gonna do it for this video. Uh, if I come across a place to get another dude, another sprite here, yeah, I'll I'll add that in. But uh, this has been Yonder. Oh, okay. Definitely gonna play more. Thank you guys for watching. Remember to stay positive. Drive yourselves a great day. I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.